Good morning. Greetings and salutations, Earthlings. Another major litter picking session today. I'm at Louth Livestock Market, Cattle Market. There's the pens behind me. Pardon the noise. There's a, there's a car wash place setting up for the morning. I picked in an area over there. Where were you? Over there. A couple of weeks ago, uh, it's another section of the car park, it's a public car park, and it's a major grot area, major grot. Uh, we're coming back today, uh, fellow picker Ian Rollick's coming as well, with tools, and he's going to bring a rake so we can get underneath the hedges, it's a huge Leylandi hedge there and a lot of windblown litter. So I'm going to get under there and take out a few bag loads, I think, today. Right, onwards, folks, because we'll catch up with you later. But then I've just been having a quick pick around this small car park, and I found a couple of bag loads in the corner here. Vodka bottles. somebody has been having a party. I don't know if these are from a private individual or from a nearby pub. But... Two bag loads. That's fly tipping, isn't it? But we'll sort it out. The job's coming along slowly. Ian has arrived. He's working away in the hedge at the moment. I had a quick count of the vodka bottles. 20. Cheap stuff. Check off vodka. I don't know if it is from Aldi. There's an Aldi shopping bag that uh, with me not being a drink, I don't know about such things. So, anyway, there's 20 more for recycling. There's a recycling centre just down the road. Back to the hedge. This is what we came here to do. We've got Ian working hard underneath the uh, hedge, it's a big Leylandi hedge, and it's a major wind trap for all the litter he's got good and dirty muddy knees muddy trousers oh, that's work that's what it's all about get underneath the hedge look pull all the stuff out look, one of those yeah they trap the animals yep oh the helicopter going over by the look of it but yeah look all underneath this hedge and I guess quick guesstimate what a hundred meters of hedge started down there and we're going to work our way through here down to the small brick building there that's what we came to do and that's what we're going to do what do you think of it so far Rubbish. That's the one. Correct answer. Right, I've just come down to another little car park which I pick regularly, at least once a week. Kidgate car park. School across the road, so that's what all the, uh, the noise is about. Um, we're picking it every week, so it starts to look clean. Um, when I first did it. I got a bag or two out of here. But now, it's pretty good. So, just, you know, five minutes and done. That's the way it should be. I just found an old broken pair of binoculars in the hedgerow. I mean, the gather room's here. This is another spot I pick once a week. Uh, still finding stuff. <laughs> uh, this was another dump when we first started picking in here but now it's a lot better once the vegetation dies off we better pick out a lot more there's a community garden in here as well quite a bit of grot at the back of there I keep finding regularly but it's improving bye <laughs> oh, it's uh, almost one o'clock how long have I been out for? Three and a half hours? 
Time for a break. Have a sit down. Tidy up. Drop off my last bag. I think I'm on my, that's my fourth bag I've got there. I might actually picked a huge amount today. Um, I've got a couple of, I'll say a couple, I mean three, tally counters, 21 plastic bottles, 26 cans, and where's the other one? Is it in the other pocket? 27 glass bottles so far. I don't think there'll be, be, be much now. Ooh, bright sunshine. Pretty much finished now. Walk back to where I dropped off the other bags and then head on home for some lunch. Salute. Bye.